12 second round matches remained at Rock Creek Park, so a busy schedule ahead for US tennis fans on Wednesday at Washington City Open. Fascinating and sure to be first of many clashes between two next generation stars of tomorrow early on stadium court. Alexander Zverev with the early edge over local lad Taylor Fritz. Moves well for big guys, Zverev, doesn't it? One break of serve was enough to see out set one and from there Fritz's resistance would crumble. A break to the good early in the second, Zverev soon had a chance to double his advantage. Yeah, he's no longer toying. With this match, he's taken firm control, got both arms wrapped firmly around it. And he gets it. Why not? That kind of performance in set number two as he runs away with the match. Far cry from the back and forth of set one. Alexander Zverev, 6-4, 6-2, as he takes down Taylor Fritz. Second seed Gao Monfils would get into action against Chinese Taipei veteran Yen Shen Lu, and the all action world number 17 was quick to go on the attack. Oh. <laughs> Gael Monfils. A moment of magic made it look so easy. Creativity on the run. A set to the good, the flamboyant Frenchman is always easy on the eye, and after grinding out an advantage early in the second, Monfils really began to put on a show. Oh, brilliant. Monfils toying with his opponent. After just over an hour of relentless movement and athleticism, Monfils had match points. Gail Monfils powers on through in Washington. A wonderful exhibition of serving, the trademark flair, and a dominant performance. And then it was the turn of American number one, John Isner, who wasn't holding back against Aussie youngster James Duckworth. Uh, that's a good extension, that wingspan, so impressive. A lot of arm strength to be able to hold that racket out, and that trampoline effect. With the set on the top seed's formidable racket, the American was clinical. He won't make that mistake five times in 30 minutes. Pretty dominant performance from the line and an early break set the table. Isner's movement around the court is remarkable for his size and the three-time Washington finalist was soon a break to the good in set two. Oh, Isner's done brilliantly. It's the right play. Isner was way behind the baseline, but he got up to the ball very well. In truth, it was a one-sided affair, and the crowd favourite was on his way to the final 16. John Isner serves his way emphatically to a place in the last 16 here in Washington. The final match of the day saw Bernard Tomic take on Donald Young for the third time. An entertaining first set saw the Aussie in front, but having to fight for every point. Oh. <laughs> Well, it wasn't for want of effort. Fantastic defence from Young, threatening to turn the rally around in his favour here. Young recovered to force a tie-break, but Tomic would edge out the nail-biting finish. And the set belongs to the Aussie. He hung tough, even though Young was really mounting a furious effort. The second set would follow a similar pattern. Both had their chances, but it was Tomic who would finally strike in game six. And Young starting to fold. Wind out of his sails and Tomic in supreme position now. Couple of holds and he's off to the round of 16. The one break would be sufficient. The match seen off in style. And he says done and dusted. Finishes with a flourish as Young puts up a fight but can outlast Tomic, who has revenge for his two losses in 2015. And then there were 16. Third round Thursday is next at the 2016 City Open. <laughs>